Hello and welcome back. So, in the last episode, we were fighting Darius and we are just wrapping that battle up. Just a few cities left. Doing pretty well. We will go after... I think we'll go after Montezuma soon, too. I mean, after we finish off uh, Darius. So let's get back into the action. And I think I'm ready to go to the next turn. We're researching democracy uh, at a cost of 82 gold per turn. Uh, we're only at 30%. We're, we are having a little bit of happiness problems. Uh, a lot of our cities are really unhappy mainly because of the war. Uh, let's take a look at it. Uh, well, these are the conquered territories, so they're unhappy because of uh, they want to join their motherland and uh, they want to, to end the war. So we're going to have to wrap it up as soon as possible. We do have several cities to go, so... Um, but luckily we'll have some roads here we can travel on and travel through Montezuma's territory, but we're going to take out Urgili and Sardis next. So we've got our buddy Peter here to help out with his horse archers. He's probably not going to be a huge help, but uh, he might be able to do something. All right. Uh, actually, I want to send more guys out. I want to get him. I'll leave the medic. Take this guy and take this war elephant. We'll all head out together. And it looks like we've got Sardis in a couple of turns. And then it'll be like three or four turns to get Urgili. And as well as uh, we're taking out Sake over here. All right. Just going to... Um, in the turn as soon as I can. Let's see if. Let's just go ahead and end the turn. We're continuing to produce troops. Um, I may get a bank here because of the money situation. We do want to not completely forget about all our tech. I mean, we are kind of wrapping things up, but um, uh, we're still going to progress a little bit. All right, let's get you to the front, cannon, and same with this cavalry. Just keep sending the reinforcements on the way. And, yep, let's see where this guy needs to go. Probably over here, yep. We'll go send him out. These guys moved. We'll move these guys. All right. We'll hit that city next turn. Let's send another guy up here, I think. And you'll join the action. Here you can, we can see our ghillie. And let's see. Let's just send him this way in case they try to sneak around here. All right. Let's send this skirmishing party up. And what do we got here? We got a couple of mace, uh, musket men, uh, and a longbow, two catapults, nothing too big. This <laughs> army should be able to take care of him. We'll get a cannon and another cavalry on the way. Uh, and we'll hit him next turn. We should be taking, maybe this is on a hill. That might be a little bit more of a challenge. This army is a little bit smaller, but we'll, we'll try to take them out. Uh, enemy has been spotted near Carthage. Let's go look at that. We might have to build some more caravels. Okay, we got a jail here. Let's go ahead and build a library. We need some culture. I need to check out this enemy near Carthage. What do we got here? Oh, it's just a galley. Can I take him out? Oh, it's also Darius's uh, caravel. So let's go ahead and take him out with our guy. 
And send this guy up here towards the front. It's going to take a while. All right. Well, let's hit him with our cannons. Do we have any accuracy guys? We do. We have one. We'll bombard. And that's it for the accuracy guys. But let's uh, let's bombard with these guys. And do I just straight up attack with my cannon? Sure. I might lose one, but yeah, it sounds like I lost one. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I lost a uh, cannon to a longbow. That's fine. All right, 99.9%. .9%. I think we can just march this army straight in. Let's do that. We got him. Let's go with a monument here. All right. I can... Oh, we got a medic. Let's promote him to cavalry for $200. Rest this guy up. Rest this guy up. All right, here we go. Another battle up here. I think uh, I can maybe take him 70%. Let's promote. I don't have any city. Oh, I do have one city raider. So that guy might be just the exception. Wait, let's take a look. 69.9%. Let's uh, wait a turn. They still got 12%. We'll hit them next turn. No no hurries up here. Um, okay, we got this guy. Let's uh, send him on his way up here. Join the battle. Get this army moved out. We'll hit here. Longbowmen outside the city so they don't get the protective bonus. Cool. And go ahead and join back with that guy. He will be able to strike next turn. So we're looking at a couple of armies over here. Uh, I may just leave these two cities and hit Montezuma next. Same with over there. Let's take a look at the uh, victory conditions. How far away are we? We still need about 24% of the land area. We're way over the population percentage, but we've got to get a lot more land. Um, so, I don't know. He's pretty weak. Let's just keep pushing it. Uh, let's see. Where do we want this guy to go? Probably just head in this direction, in this general direction, and we need to hit this city over here. I think I... Let me think about this for a second. So, we still need 20%, but if he capitulates, I think uh, I think it does count a little bit towards my land area. I'm not really sure. But no matter what, we're going to have to hit Montezuma. So I think just these two cities. I'm not going to go for Zohak over there. I'm going to go for these two cities. So therefore, I want to start moving guys, start planning my attack on Montezuma. Let's send a cavalry out to scout to scout Montezuma just a little bit. Uh, you're a medic, but nobody is super wounded, so we'll go ahead and send you out. Okay, they do have musketmen. All right, let's take a look at Montezuma and see what kind of text he has. So he can research astronomy. He wants chemistry. He doesn't have it. He wants nationalism. So we can see that he's got... He's got, wait, uh, where was my cavalry guy? Okay, he's got some muskets, but not much else. I'm going to go ahead and start preparing for that battle pretty soon. We got a long ways. He's got such big culture benefits. Um, let's go ahead and park some guys in pretty much every city. I'm going to finish up these two cities up here. I mean... This city down here, Urgili, and 
Sakai, and then we'll hit we'll hit Montezuma after that. But I'm gonna have to reorganize my military just a little bit. Um, let's go ahead and intern right now. All right, we're getting hit by this barbed galley. That shouldn't be any big big deal to us. Okay, we got that. We'll go theater. Just defend here. We need to keep a lot of defense in our cities when we go to war with Montezuma. All right, we'll hit this city and take it out. We did lose a cavalry. All right, we'll go with that. All right, you're gonna go down this turn. A Russian revolt in Moscow. I thought I was doing pretty good on the culture here. Wow. Huh. Interesting. Well, I survived it. I didn't lose the city just yet. We'll have to pump out culture to remember to do that. Uh, maybe just build culture. Yeah. Wow. I didn't realize. We had uh, a lot of borders before. Russia's really expanded. Okay. Let's take this guy out. We got a 77% chance. All right, we survived. Oh, no, we don't have enough guys to take him out this turn. We'll have to wait one more turn. Send this cavalry in for reinforcements. Okay, he can hit him. All right, he can hit him. Let's go. Oh, no, he can't. He already tacked this turn. All right, we'll send this guy. We'll, we'll make sure and heal up. Where's a medic? Oh, there's two medics here, so let's send him up here. Send these guys out. Let's send the catapults first. Then the rifleman. Make sure there's a rifleman in here. There is not. You will be stationed here. And it's going to be a couple turns before I declare war. Oh, no, I promoted the whole stack. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, well. Um, okay, let's send the cavalry first. And this last guy, you'll go in here. And you're just going to... I think uh, fog bust here, so no more barbed galleys spawn. That's fine. All right, we got a great spy. Do we build the Scotland Yard, or do we just infiltrate the player city? We can go to Montezuma. Uh, let's stop spying on Darius. Just go down to one. Let's go ten on him. How are we doing on um, Montezuma? Uh, not very well. He's. Uh, we can't really see much of his stuff. So... Um, we're really, let's go ahead and infiltrate him. Let's send him on his way to, uh, the capital. Five turns and then get some spying on him. All right. We want to make sure that our cities are well defended. And, oh yeah, next turn we'll make peace. I want to hit this guy. Might not survive it. Send another cavalry. We'll see. Got him. Good. So we'll send him on the way. Send him. How's this army doing? Okay. Um, let's see. We want to make sure that we have one guy here. These guys will go here. All right. Um, do I want to upgrade another? This guy's pretty decent. Just automate him. We'll rest. And, yeah, just rest this guy. Okay. I still want to take this city up here. We'll do that. Uh, we're almost completely surrounded. Two turns to democracy, then we'll get... Um, uh, maybe do a civics change, get free speech. We don't. I don't think we need bureaucracy anymore. 
Peter wants to give us horses. We already have horses. No, we don't want to do that. But we got a bank. Let's go ahead and do some more cavalry. Uh, where's my great spy? It's going to be hard to find him, isn't it? So, look at all units here. My great spy is right here. Can I golden age him? I need one more. Do I want to change my civics? No, I don't. I really don't. I don't need to change my civics. Let's just keep going. I don't think anybody's got emancipation just yet. Uh, these guys are resistance. Does anybody have emancipation? No. So we're okay on that front. We'll go one more turn. Get this guy up closer to the front. You too. All right, here we go. We're going to hit him now. Looks like he reinforced quite a bit. Uh, but I can smash him again. And take these guys. Smash him again. Got it. Now we'll do monument and we'll peace out with Darius. Uh, let's see. You will give us cap capitulation and economics. Thank you very much. And we can do open borders. And we got any trades we want to do? We can get some gold for some rice. How about that? We'll get some silk for some corn. What else you got? Uh, deer for pig. Wow, we're getting a lot of good deals here. This is going to really help. Compound interest All right. is the most powerful force in the universe. Yeah, I do want a civics change. I can get representation and free speech and free market. It's a lot of... Let's see. We've got a lot of... We've got some cities revolting. Maybe now is a good time for civics change. Oh, let's go ahead and do it. Representation, free speech, and free markets. I want to keep organized religion. I could go free religion, get some bonus in research, but I don't really need to do that. All right, two turns of anarchy. That's fine. Um, we'll get our city. We'll, we'll get our revolution under control, and then we'll attack Montezuma. And we'll give us time for our great spy to get over there. We'll heal up. Um, and just uh, attack. So we're okay here. This is going to be a staging area. Make sure that guy is unselected. We need one guy at least. Let's leave the elephant too, just in case they send somebody. All right, let's go. Send these guys so they can heal right away. I do have a medic here. I do not make a medic. So we'll be good to go in three turns. And Oh, Aztec revolt here. Oh, that's no good. They've got a lot of culture going. So, I don't know. No upgrades right now. One more turn of anarchy. We see some enemy. Who might that be? Oh, it's just a, it's a barbarian. Well, we got a couple of catapults. I mean, cavalry that can take care of that. All right, get you back up here. And I don't need all these guys here. So send him up here, too. Uh, 
And um, one more turn to democracy. It has been said all right. that democracy uh, is the worst form of government. Go with uh, steam power. That have been tried. And just get some theaters going. Uh, I'll vote for myself. I'll probably win that. So, what's going on in Moscow? I was wanting to do culture, right? Let's just build culture up so we don't revolt here. And I need to keep this guy here so that we can fight off the revolts. All right. So from here, one, two, three, four. It, he's got so much culture surrounding his cities. Okay. Let's go ahead and infiltrate the player city. Or how many uh, espionage points will that give us? Let's take a look at what we have before. We're at 828. And if I do this, how many points does that give us? And that gives us... 3,828. We should be able to see his cities next turn. Good. Uh, so we'll be able to see everything he's doing. Cool. Maybe I need more guys over here. Let's send this cannon out. Make sure these guys head up here. Need some cavalry up there, I think. Let's send at least three guys. That's going to be a good staging area. Probably need some more riflemen. Let's send this city raider out. And let's end the turn. So we're, we can go through Darius's territory to attack this city. So I want to send the catapult up here. I mean a cannon, of course. We still have some healing to do. But we'll get there. We'll get there. We'll declare war soon enough. All right. Need culture here. Maybe just research culture. So I won that boat. All right. Well, this is way too many cavalry up here. Let's send a couple in here. Spread them out a little bit. Send more guys up here. And you're just resting. So I can see all the cities, what he's working on. Mostly macemen and longbowmen and a few musket men, but he doesn't have much. He's got some knights and some elephants, but we should be able to take him out. Not too worried. Although, he does have a lot of guys. Let's, uh, let's do some upgrading. Get more cannons. How are we doing on happiness? We're doing pretty good. So I actually don't need to be doing so much culture. Let's just stick it at 10%. Help out Moscow a little bit. Uh, we've got a 1.59% chance of a revolt. Definitely don't want to lose Moscow. So we're doing 107 culture per turn. we got to get this up to 50%, I think. So we'll keep keep pushing out the culture there. All right, more cavalry. We just need to keep doing cavalry. Town is totally choked. But hopefully we'll be able to attack soon and get some relief for them. All right, um, let's get over there, you two. Oh, there's Russia again, One point. Five nine percent. Of course, it happened right away. Man, Moscow. What happened? Just a one percent chance. It should be once every hundred turns, not every turn. That's just 
stupid. I guess that's just the way it works. I mean, that's just, you just get unlucky sometimes. You just don't realize how many times you actually get lucky. You always tend to view things pessimistically. Anyway, I think just get more culture. And keep sending more guys to the front. Okay, I think I've done enough. I don't really need steam power. I'm about to take out Montezuma. Let's just crank out the culture. Push up our push out our borders. We we still need thirteen percent. I mean, we definitely have to go to war with Montezuma. Pushing out the culture a little bit will help, especially help keep Moscow uh, from revolting too much. Let's send a couple of guys over here just to protect against revolts. And upgrade those guys. All right, continue to do culture. No. More culture. Gonna just defend. All right. Am I ready to go to war? Let's see. I'm gonna leave one cavalry here. Take you and my army. And like that. Move them there. I'll go I'll declare war next turn. Not this turn. We'll do it next turn. All right, we'll send an army here towards this city. We'll send an army here towards this city. And another army over this way. These guys actually don't really have any cities to attack. So they'll join the attack here. So let's go ahead and get them ready. We'll save two. Rifleman and the cavalry. Let's just get them ready. I'm going to go ahead and promote these guys to city protections. And just leave him there for now. Wait till next turn. They'll be joined by this army. Like that. And then we'll head out. Here, we're going to just absolutely crush Montezuma. Yep, no problems. I don't see any real difficulties. He doesn't have a lot of horsemen. He's got a few knights over here. They could, they'll could they definitely cause some problems. A few catapults, but for the most part, he's pretty weak. Got to make sure we defend what we have. Let's do some upgrading. Uh, upgrade some of these elephants. This city's okay. It's far enough behind borders. He can't use the roads. He's got some guys in our territory, but I'm not worried about them. All right. Let's go. Next turn, we'll go to war. All right. I'm the wealthiest civilization. Nice. And you just keep pumping up the super experienced cavalry there. That'll be great. Live uh, theater. And we will go to war. Um, let's go in here and. There we go. Uh, yeah, we're going to war. All right, let's send a small force out this way. Really should have had more troops here. Uh, we'll go up here. We've got this guy coming. And, yep, you'll all go down here. We don't have much in the north. we got to get more guys up north, I think. Uh, yeah, you're going to go over here. Let's make sure we bring everybody. And you're just going to defend. And... Um, 
me just get a couple guys. Get these knights. And we do need a bunch of guys to try to help out. Well, we got... We'll help out over here. They can get there in three turns. Uh, it's fine. Let's just send all these guys up to attack this city up here. I mean, up here. And I think uh, you can just defend. Make sure this guy gets promoted. These guys are need to be promoted. Because we could get attacked here. They've got... really don't have much. They do have some knights. I'm worried about... Those knights will do some damage, for sure. Make sure we get all these guys promoted. If I do lose a town, I can retake it pretty easily. Oh, they took my worker. It's fine. Yeah, here they go. They may take out a city, but I got this big stack here to just take it back. All right, we will do a theater if they need one. Yep. And looks like they're coming after this city. We'll promote this guy and move him in to protect the town. I don't really care what you're doing with that elephant. Actually, I'll hit you with cavalry. Elephants have the bonus to mounted, but they don't have enough initial strength to do to be a threat. We got a ninety over ninety percent chance of survival. Back in the city. Get this guy back in the city. Alright, I'm gonna defend, upgrade him, and I mean promote him. Here we go. So we got a knight over here. Can I hit him? Yeah. Crossing a river, but we got him. Cavalry. All right, gonna defend this city. That's fine. I don't know. Uh, they won't. Just two guys there. That's it. We don't need to worry about that. We really need to take a couple of cities to win this game, honestly, because um, we've got we're re we're getting really close. I think I will leave a couple of. Cavalry here. Actually, let's just go ahead and strike. And then take a couple guys here. Strike these guys. And move the rest out. Actually, that kind of made me a little bit weak. But for this attack, but they only got four guys in there. And yeah, we should be able to take a couple of cities next turn, maybe. What else we got? Nobody threatening us. We'll take, yeah. Oh no, I lost another worker. And might be losing a cavalry. Yep, lost a cavalry. Oh, there's his big stack. He's got a big stack. Wow. Uh, let's hit this elephant. Yeah, he's got a big stack right there. I can hit him with my cannons. When he gets closer, he'll probably jump on this hill right here. Uh, not that guy. Let's get some first strike guys, because he's got some 
trebuchets. Well, he's got a bunch of catapults and a trebuchet. He'll probably go after my culture. I mean, try to take my defenses down first. So I'll have a turn to hit him with my cannons. With my cannon. And... But I've got a bunch of guys defending this city. So we'll be okay. Let's promote this guy, get him here healing. Uh, heal up. And looks like we'll take this city. Yeah, for sure. Uh, got it. Nice. And we'll just go in here for now. Do I want to push the attack? They might need some help over here. Or do I wait? I wait a turn. Go ahead and attack him. <laughs> And we've got some space here now, so we'll send these guys out. So now I can send my ca cannons out. Because we got an extra defender. Alright, this city's gone. I got this city taken care of, I think. Let's see, how many accuracy guys do I have? A bunch. Let's hit them. And then we've got some other guys that can get the accuracy. Okay, he's got accuracy. You've got accuracy. Okay, there we go. Let's just make these all city raiders and get them. And start just hit them with my cavalry. And. Take out his bowmen. Oh no, they've already attacked. Let's see. Ah. Uh, let's uh, save one guy here, send the rest in the city. All right, so we're going to hit this. Uh, we're going to go to next turn. We're going to see what he does with his big stack over here. I think uh, I'm going to leave these guys here to defend my cannons. And let's get some more guys reinforcing. He's got a really giant stack here of got some catapults. Hopefully, let's just go ahead and put this guy into Carthage. Get some overpowered uh, cross uh, cavalry. All right, uh, what do I do with this guy? Let's see if we can hit this knight with our cavalry over here. Got him. There we go. And get this guy down here. I am a little concerned about this town, but I think we'll be all right. That is a big stack, but we've got all these cannons. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have a road here. So we won't be able to hit them next turn. Um, but we do have one cannon in here. And that will do some damage. And we've got a lot of protective riflemen. We've got some cavalry in this city. So we might be okay. We'll probably be able to... I don't know if we'll get that town next turn. But uh, let's just see how this goes. Okay, he went down here and attacked us here. That's not what I expected. Interesting. And he's not attacking my big stack. Well, he's attacking my cannons. Oh, wow. They're not in any protective position. He's going to wipe out some of my cannons, I'm pretty sure. Let's see what... Okay, we've got his chariots we're doing good so far trebuchets don't do as much collateral damage as catapults we 
we're still winning. We just way out tech him. I mean, our guys are way more advanced, and uh, even with a big stack and hitting us with uh, catapults, it's not doing enough. And we had a big stack of cannons here, too. We might lose a couple, but I think uh, we're going to come out on top of this exchange. Well, we didn't lose anybody, and it wiped. they threw their entire stack at us. So that was uh, what we wanted. Not what I expected, but it's what I, I like the at outcome. All right, just pick whatever for now. His stack is completely gone, and our cannons are still standing pretty strong. They're damaged, but um, still hanging in there. All right, well, let's... Uh, Let's see what we can do here. Um, we've got four guys. We've got four guys. Let's go in and see if we can take them this turn. Got them. And let's uh, get some defenses. And get our overpowered cavalry. Well, we'll be even more overpowered with this guy. Giving him more combat experience. And send him to the front. And you're just going to rest up here. And I can send like three guys here to the front lines. How are we doing on our uh, domination? Okay, we've got it next turn. So... I'm just going to see if uh, I can peace out with uh, Montezuma. Uh, let's just uh, let's see. Will you capitulate? Nice. All right. There we go. Um, we did it. We got him. And um, let's see. Let's do this. Gonna do open borders, and why not get some resources from him if he has anything we don't have? Spices, yeah, for fish. There you go. Wine, sugar, silk. We have everything. Dye. Okay. So let's just get these guys into the cities, and just a few turns, we should have. The culture, I mean, the domination victory. All right. Just got to get my guys in the cities. Let's do 100% culture. It, all right. We got it. Domination victory. Here we go, plant our flag over the whole world. So that ended up being a little bit easier than I thought. I moved up from Prince difficulty to Monarch. I did not implement slavery, which is kind of actually normal for me. I realize that slavery is like an overpowered uh, civic, and a lot of times I just don't use it. So it was kind of a challenge, but it challenge video but uh, it's something that I do often um, but I think uh, I might uh, uh, have to try to up the difficulty somehow next next let's play because this seemed a little bit too easy so let's see we got it's hard to tell the orange from the orange but there we took out the, the William and then Moscow and then finally we did the Darius and Montezuma, and then we got our domination victory. Uh, let's take a look. Take a look at our at the stats here. All right, you look at. Let's look at it for like a hundred turns. At the beginning. 
Let's see. We're this orange here on the very bottom. We're really on the bottom here. William Van Orange was, um, he took a, a jump up here, and we were still trying to catch him for a while. Let's do like 200 turns. So, yeah, here we are where we did that war with William Orange, and we jumped, he crashed down. It didn't really help us too much right away. Darius started running away with it. Montezuma started running away with it. But then I went to war with Russia, and that's when my cities from him started to become a little bit better. And we dropped down his score over here. And then we shot up to the top. We're kind of neck and neck with Darius for a while. Then we take out Darius. And then finally, of course, we took out Montezuma. And I got 116,090. That's a pretty good score for me. Let's see if that is my best game on this computer. It is by far. Um, not bad at all. Um, 17.25 finish date is also my quickest finish date. And, um, yeah, not bad. All right, well, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.